Okay, we're off to a great start. I'm one of two people in the lobby, so there is no way we can actually play this. Okay, next game we're trying Breakthrough, one of three players. Again, a great start. Okay, so I enabled crossplay because I wanted to play on the new map, Kaleidoscope. Well, it's not a new map, but they changed a bunch of things. So it should play a little bit better, even that guy uh, asked it. So we're gonna find out now. Race the five gigs, okay, well. Look at this, there's a guy right there. There's a guy on top of the freaking uh, bridge. Get down. Let's see what will happen. Look, 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 look. Um. <laughs> oh my goodness, he died. That was pretty funny. So anyway, like I said, let's check out the new area. So B1 is a new section of the map. Pretty cool, I guess. Like a little close quarter combat area. I like that. Nothing too special, though. Oh, bruh. Well, in the new update, the uh, stealth helicopters should be nerfed. That looked pretty powerful, though, so... Okay, we got him. Now, let's actually find out if the aim assist has been fixed or not. We're using the uh, BSVM or whatever it's called. This one has also been nerfed because this was, without a doubt, the best gun in the game before the update. Uh, so, let's see what they did with this gun and what they did with the aim assist because I want to know if they actually fixed it. I kind of doubt it though, not gonna lie. There was one update, I believe, where it got improved slightly, but then after that, it got I got broken again, in my opinion. So, I don't know, guys. That's one. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. These are obviously very bad indicators, but, you know, right now I don't notice any noticeable good difference. You know what I mean? It still feels pretty garbage. Okay, so that was Kaleidoscope. Uh, other than that one section on the B flag, I didn't really notice any difference in terms of the map layout or the, you know, flow of the map. So, make of that what you will. Now, let's actually test the aim assist. Hmm, garbage aim on my part, or still messed up aim is this? <laughs> I don't know, we'll keep trying. I don't even know what a good weapon is, you know, to kind of try out the aim is this, because there's no consistency in any of these guns, it feels like. Okay, that didn't feel too bad, but again, it's not really an indication so far. If only they added the portal game mode guns, that would increase the amount of guns we have in this game by... A lot. What the frick is this? Look, so they changed some of the fa oh. they changed some of the faces for the uh, for the specialist, which makes them look quote unquote more war torn, I guess. They do look better, but it's not anything significant, which is you know kind of the uh, whole theme of this update so far. Aim assist doesn't feel much different, if different at all. The kaleidoscope remake is okay, but besides the one point, it's kind of meh. So I don't know what to tell you guys. I guess we're gonna do some sniping, maybe that will help us determine whether or not there is a better aim assist. Hmm, that doesn't count. That doesn't say anything. I did feel some sort of aim assist, but I don't know if it was good aim assist or bad aim assist. Why can they just, just straight up copy and paste the aim assist system, mechanic, whatever you want to call it, from Battlefield 5? Nobody ever complained about the aim assist in Battlefield 5. You know why? Because it was pretty much perfect. Oh, there are multiple people here. I'm out of here. <sighs> wow. Oh, I got a freaking double or a collab with this stupid pistol. Okay, so I'm better off using the pistol for some reason. Still don't have a good indication for the aim assist. Oh, come on, dude. Give me a break here. Okay, maybe that's just me. Accounting for the garbage aim assist before the update. 
Believe it or not, but sniping does feel better after the update. Maybe I'm somehow biased, but I don't know. Sniping feels a little bit better. Just a little bit. Look at that. They uh, removed the voices. They don't say anything stupid anymore, it seems like. Interesting. The faces also seem more greedy, like I said before. So I guess that's a good thing. Oh, I got him. Oh, all the way from there? Interesting. Oh, there's no way I will hit him. There's no way. Look how far... Oh, wait. Oh, I actually hit him. I actually hit him. Look at the bullet drop on this thing. Oh, I killed him. Oh, the hang time of that bullet was like freaking seven years. That's insane. Look at this guy. Why are they still hilltop camping right now? What is the point? You're not near an objective or anything. Unbelievable. I literally don't have any words for that. That was half decent, I guess. Who is shooting me? I can't even see where the bullets are coming from. Look. Who is shooting me? That wasn't the guy. That wasn't the guy either. Ooh, three headshots back to back. That's pretty nice, I guess. Ooh, damn. Man, this is the most annoying game I've played so far in Battlefield 2042. Die. How is that not a headshot, bro? That's more like it. There we go. Headshot? It's easier to snipe after the update. 100%. You made it oh! Well, he got me too, but I don't care. This guy camps the entire time at the back of the map in his base to snipe from like... 1500 meters away, why would you do that? Okay, final chance, we're gonna try if the aim assist has actually been improved or not because so far I don't see or notice anything. Oh, maybe it's just me guys, maybe it's just me. I don't know bro, I don't know. Like, for real, I'm not even playing. Like, I want the aim assist to be fixed. So if I feel it's fixed, then that's it, you know. I won't, I won't sugarcoat it or anything. But so far, I don't really notice... Get the hell out of here. Maybe this gun is just garbage. Let's put on this thing. No, no, no. It doesn't feel good at all. The sentry, of course, the freaking sentry. <laughs> I don't know, man. The aim is. I don't think it feels better. I don't think it feels better. As much as I want it to feel better, I don't think it feels better. Like, what do you want me to do? Look, no, 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 no. It's exactly the same almost. Bro, there ain't no way that I'm missing these easy shots. Something is going on. It feels like the Amosis has been like, um, what do you call it? It's been, it's not worse. It feels like really bad actually. Bro, Amosis feels worse. I'm not playing with you guys. Let's put on a suppressor, why not? There's a tank right there. I'm gonna destroy it with my, uh, Oh, hello. Well, now I don't have enough C4 for the tank. For some reason, I knew he was gonna jump down. Let me get the hell out of here. No, he didn't die? 
There are two tanks? I'm not even joking, the aim assist feels worse. Well, oh, that was it? We already won? The game just started. Well, I'll take it. I don't want to play this game anymore. So, conclusion of this whole update. Only sniping feels better for some reason. I can't pinpoint the reason why, but sniping feels better. Everything else feels pretty much the same. I would even go as far as saying that the aim assist is now worse. Yes, I know. People think I must be joking, but I genuinely feel... Like the aim assist is worse off compared to, you know, before the update. That's just my two cents. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know down below what you think. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Drop a like. You can join the Discord. Link for that is down below. And with that being said, I see you guys next time. <laughs>